So we met up with our Dutch friends over there, had a nice potluck dinner. We're in Carlsbad Bad City on some boondocking spot, BLM land or something. Nice little lake behind us. Sun's just setting. And um, we're just having a but why is it relaxing? Very nice night. A little windy, but it's finally dying down. Thanks for watching. More to come. In the caverns? Yeah. Probably not. Uh -huh. All right, so we stayed over in Carlsbad City in this awful BLM land. I don't know what it was. Avalon Reservoir. So it's just it was a nice area, but then the it has great potential. Yeah, we were on over an overview of a lake. Met, met up with the Dutch people, Will and Maria, and had a great time. That's what made it worthwhile. Then we noticed there was about one million nails in the parking lot in the gravel area. And lots of broken glass and garbage. A lot of kids, high school kids there. Then around 10 o'clock, the sheriff came back on both our, both our RVs and just checking up, but they're really nice, actually. And then uh, two in the morning, someone drove. By, uh, then after they left, then someone there on ten o'clock was playing Metallica up on the higher parking lot. Loud. They didn't stay long, which was fine. And the train went by with the train was loud. Horn, but that was fairly early. And then uh, two a.m., a car came slowly creeping by, went down, and had some smokes and who knows what else. By the water. By the water. And then five in the morning, someone came by. Then the dumpster area, which was down, you know, just a little ways from us, we noticed that there was some smoldering, smoldering ashes. In this morning. This morning, I don't know what that was all about. And then after we got back on the main road, I checked our tires, and there's a nail sticking out of one of our tires. So we drove to a tire shop, and they pulled it and put some water on it. Luckily, it didn't puncture the tire, but that that, that could have been worse. It has such great potential. I mean, it's a beautiful spot over the reservoir in the middle of the desert. And then the, the sheriff told the Dutch people that there's some drugs there and people do some uh, clay sh pitch shooting stuff. There were a lot of shells, empty shells there and stuff. So Mrs. Landmark's going to write a thorough review on that on Campendium to just to update everybody to probably steer clear of the area. It only did get two stars. We should have known better. So now we're on our way to the caverns. We're to come. Thanks for watching. Okay, we're on our way down to the cave entrance for the stairs. We, we spent the five bucks and got the audio tour. It's better be worth it, Rimpler. It's uh, Monday afternoon, about noon. The place is already really crazy busy. I'm surprised. We're inside the cave and it's really dark. And I shouldn't have watched The Descent last night. That was a bad idea. I'm a little claustrophobic, but so far I'm doing okay. 